Good morning, good morning, you guys. It's me giving you an update on how things are going, giving you an update and give you a motivational speech this morning. Um, the holidays have come, some are coming, have came and went, and some are coming still. For the holidays, you guys, those of you that are single or those of you that are by yourself, Take this time to enjoy your life still. Don't get depressed on these days. I know it's hard and it's easier said than done. But I'm here to tell you today that um, how I defeated the sadness, the loneliness, how I felt I defeated the process of being in this situation as a target individual. And those of you that don't know what a target individual is, those are people that are constantly harassed due to something that they did that they felt was right. And they stood their grounds and did not allow themselves to be bullied into silence. So I spoke it into existence. I didn't say, at first I used to pray the same prayer and say, dear Lord, I pray for happiness. I pray that I will have a good day. I pray that the harassment will say, stop. Then I turned it around and said, dear Lord, I thank you because I know today I'm having a good day. Dear Lord, I thank you in advance because I know that you're going to fight my enemies for me. Dear Lord, I know that you are here to help me get financial blessings and it will come. You see, the power of your mind will change your life. And I promise you, you guys, tears is in my eyes right now because from what I came from into what I am today, I'm thankful. Being a target individual gave me the strength to love thyself and not depend on nobody else because it showed me who everybody was. Okay, that's what I got out of it. First, I was bitter and I said, oh, I'm not messing with nobody. I'm not about to have no friends, no family I'm be by myself. And then one day I woke up and said, I'm going to take my family back. I wish the devil is a lie. The devil is a lie. I said, I rebuke you in the name of Jesus, devil. You are not about to keep my family. And even though, you know, it might be not 100% trust in them, but they there. You get what I'm saying? They are there where I feel that they are doing what a family member would do in this situation if they don't know the truth they self. I mean, if I call them and say, you know what, you guys, I'm in a bind. They're there. You get what I'm trying to say? But as far as me going out and hanging out, I still don't feel comfortable. So I don't do it as much. I do it when I am in that mind state to control my environment yes there's still some drama but the ones that you know create drama i don't even try to create a foundation with them but the ones i was birthed with devil you can't have them i was birthed and raised in the same household with these people devil i will not give them to you my kids i would not give them to you devil i'm gonna pray over them if i gotta lay hands on them the devil tried to take my son from me more than one time to turn him against me some of you guys go through that too with your own siblings, okay? With your own child, your own friends, okay? The devil tried to take my best friend from me by using my own family to turn her against us, each other, you know? And I said, the devil is a lie. I rebuke that. You will not take my friend from me, okay? So that's what I said. It's all in your head. Change the patterns of your life. If your pattern of your life is, I'm going to get up, go to work, make this money, that's it, come home. No, so I'm going to get up and I'm going to have a good day at work. The mobbing at work is not going to hinder me today. I'm going to say, hi, how you guys doing? I'm going to have a good day and I claim it. Claim the process. Those of you that are single and you're dealing with this non-trust factor. Say, dear Lord, I claim that you will send me that man that's going to support me, that I can trust, that's going to help me. And I pray you don't understand that these people are going against you hard. But they don't understand that you know somebody that's harder than them. That's somebody that can defeat them in the end. But I do. But I do. But I do. But I do. And I want you to as well. When you watch this video, please just make a light bulb come on your head. And then after this, you start saying words. When you speak those words, speak it into existence. I'm going to have a good day. The enemy is not going to win today. Thank you, Lord, for the day that I'm about to receive. Thank you, Lord, for the blessings that are coming towards me because I'm fighting this battle and I'm still connected to you and i'm still believing in you lord it's for a purpose please help me figure out that purpose okay that's all i want you guys to know change your mind frame and i promise you it's going to get easier 
I promise you it's going to get easier. I'm not making this up. I'm not no fake tea. I'm really going through it. Some days I'm depressed because, you know, I'm like, Lord, why me? Why me? Then I looked myself in the mirror and said, I know it's why you, because you got a, a roar of a lion. It's in you. It wasn't there before. I used to purr like a kitten, but then now, man, <laughs> I promise you, I got to roar like a lion now, and I'm not afraid to roar. You get what I'm trying to say? You get what I'm trying to say? When you look at all the good instead of the bad that's going on by being a T.I., you're going to look at yourself, dang, God, you did bring me to a place where I learned to be, have peace within myself. You did bring me to a place where I learned to accept and learn who was good. Everybody can go with you where you're trying to go. If you're trying to go into those golden gates, God had a sorry put you in a situation so you can see that Keisha, John, Mally, whoever can't go with you. And I'm going to show you why. He showed you and it hurts. But he's showing you to get you away from those people because you are better than that. So I'm going to keep this video short, less than 10 minutes. But I just want you to say that change your patterns of life. Meaning if you wake up every day and you pray the same prayer, it's time to stop praying a different prayer but with meaning. Because it's going to happen. It's going to happen. If you say, Lord, I pray for a financial blessing. I've been searching for a job, Jesus. Please give me a job. Please, George, that I can handle. And that's the same thing that happened to me. I didn't want to work in a place where I felt like I couldn't handle the people that was going to mom me. So he blessed me with a private entity, with godly people. At first, these people were into, I blessed, believing whatever, whatever situation that these people were falsifying against me. I can tell. I can tell because, you know, God has given me the power to see things that I shouldn't see, right? And the next thing I know, these people are so loving. God is good. God is good. These people are loving, godly people that can see right from wrong, okay? So just please speak that into existence, you guys. I'm sorry just looking at my little car meters and all that stuff, but you know how it is. I still don't come on here and show on my face and do all that because you still have people that have, lacks intelligence to believe that this is real so when they see you they think you're crazy no i'm not crazy blue white i got all the proof on the other videos if you want to go down my whole timeline but in the name of jesus i claim it the enemy will fall and when he fall he's gonna fall hard jesus Amen. Talk to you guys later. I'm sorry for those of you that don't believe in the word of God yet. And that's all you hear me say. Amen. That's the only way you're going to defeat this. We're not fighting the flesh and blood. We're fighting these demonic spirit that are attacking you. I promise you. It's not flesh and blood. It's these demonic spirits. And if you don't believe in demonic spirits, you better read about it and go against it. Because I have family members that I know for a fact that they believe in God. But if they're not covered enough to get these demons off of them the demons are turning them into the devil's advocates and they don't even realize that you are advocating for the devil why are you doing these things and they and they look at you like they don't even know what they what we're talking about they look at you like i don't even about i didn't say that yes you did say that and they they real argue like i did not say so yes you did why did you do that um and just have a blank stare i promise you I promise you, but I, like I said, I'm going to keep less than 10 minutes. God is good. Have a good day, you guys.